Hey there, Mission Control. Well, we're continuing the installation of the Cube into the, uh, the delivery vehicle, the Expedition. The Cube into the Expedition, that sounds cool. And uh, got the panels all painted, and I've lifted them up off the floor and got the heater going directly on them since it's so cold out today. I want to make sure everything's nice and dry before we start cutting. The only bad thing about painting first is that my hands are dirty, so as I touch it, I'm going to leave some handprints behind that might have to be touched up once we get it all in. But uh, such is life. So what we're going to do is we're going to cut everything, measure it, cut it, and actually put it into the cube and install it. We're going to find out some different ways. I might have to use liquid nails to install it, um, but I'm hoping some of the screws I bought will work as well. We'll find out. And uh, yeah, this thing's really going to start to take shape now, so let's get started. Getting harder and harder to put it together. Less and less access. There we go. It's nice. So the good news is I'm on my last piece. The bad news is I ran out of the self-tapping screws, so time to drill all my pilot holes. All right, I just got the outside of the cube all done. So that means all the panels are in, the doors are in. Let me show you here. So I can open this door here. I need to put a handle on for just that reason. It's a little tight. Right, yeah, I'm gonna have to have a handle on. Come to the back here. Okay, there we go. There it is. So now I gotta get the insulation over the bare wood. Get some handles on this guy and it's gonna be looking pretty sharp. So the next step I gotta do is I'm gonna uh, put insulation in. And I think what I wanna do is I'm gonna leave the floor open. I wanna put the insulation up here on the sides but leave the floor as it is, and I'm, I may eventually put some covering on the floor like a linoleum or something, but for right now I think it's going to be fine. Uh, but I, there's no point in putting foam down at the bottom because heat rises. So, I'm going to use liquid nails, going to seal this up in place, and we're going to get started cutting the ones on the side. So I called it liquid nails, but it's actually P Pro Line 200. Project construction adhesive.
One section's in. I got the ceiling in and the first two walls. Now I gotta do the back ceiling and its walls and the inside will be insulated. I've done cutting all of the uh, insulation, getting it in, and man, it turned out pretty nice. I forgot to get some foil tape so I can tape up some corners and seams, but otherwise, really, really happy with how it turned out. I've got the heater going in there right now because I have the adhesive in. It's pretty cold outside, so I doubt it will set very well. I'm just gonna give it some extra heat. Uh, definitely very, very happy. So, I'm going to end this video here, uh, still got some more work to do on it, uh, but I'm going to go ahead and cut you guys loose, thanks so much for following along, uh, I hope you did enjoy it, if you did enjoy this video, be sure to give us a thumbs up and hit subscribe, you can also follow us on Facebook and Twitter, in the meantime, this is The Real Marshall, out.